So I have good news, and that is I've identified the cause, the root cause of the starting problem, and it is the neutral switch. And I'd like to give a, th a shout out to Dr. ATV online, uh, who has a, a very nice uh, store for Honda parts. And I just simply sent uh, Dr. ATV an email asking for advice. And um, actually, I was thinking about replacing a relay. And uh, he came back and said, just try, first of all, shorting out, sorry, grounding the neutral switch. And so all I've done there is I've just got a couple of little a cable here with crocodile clips on both sides. Um, just ground that there. You see that? Let me just take that off there. So there's the neutral switch, and I'm going to order one from him. And I just place one crocodile clip on here, and I just earthed the other one. Just ground it here to the fr to the um, the casing, and of course this is already ground out. So, uh, and then with that. If I can find the neutral switch and find the key switch with all this going on here, I turn the light on, turn the ignition on, and you see the lights come on there. And then I go to the power switch, uh, turn that on, press this, and simple as that. So now that I've completely disassembled the bike, uh, I know I've had to take quite a bit apart anyway because I'm doing the carb, I'm doing the bulbs, but um, I don't know, maybe uh, hindsight is twenty twenty, and maybe I should have just tried this first of all. Um, but anyway, it's been a great learning experience and um, what I'll do is I'll get a new neutral switch and put that in there and then we should be good to go.